All right, what up, nerds? Back at it again on this sunny, hot, steamy day as we review another steak for you. And uh, from last week to this week, huge difference. And um, we're excited to share, uh, share this one with you. Huge. We're here at the uh, <laughs> the original Thunderbird Steaks, correct? Yes. yes. And that is in Broomall, and that's on Westchester Pike. So, uh, and this one did not let us down at all. So, um, we got these guys start off with how they feel about the steak, and we'll go from there. Uh, very good steak this week. It wasn't, uh, but I like a little, like, it wasn't like real thinly chopped up. Gave us some big portions of meat on the sandwich. Solid roll from, what, Concha Hocken? Yeah, Concha Hocken Bakery. 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 Yeah. And, uh, there you go. You be the day. Uh, yeah. It's, one, we never even heard of that because we had some, we never, like, had these kind of rolls before. And he said, yeah, he gets from Concha Hocken. He's, uh, done with the whole Amoroso thing. So... Yeah, because he told us it's about the water. So yeah. water. It's, it's all about the water because they switched over to the Jersey. And now when, ever since they went to Jersey, they said their rolls aren't the same. So, And, I mean, we tasted a bunch of Amoroso rolls. This is a big yes. difference. Yeah, oh, yeah, difference. this was good. This is a very good roll. Crispy on the outside, soft on the inside. Yeah. Uh, good. Cheese, man. Yeah, Wiz was good. Wiz was all throughout. <laughs> the onions, though. This is the first time I think... We have the onions the way like nice and thin. Oh god, not was, the there were long, the little squares. long like, thin onions where you could actually taste the flavor on these. Yeah. They weren't diced, they weren't chopped, they were it's it's kind of shredded. It, they, yeah, they were yeah. like shredded, shredded onions and it was it was unbelievable. Like you could big difference in taste when this happens. And the cheese, the American cheese, they it was good. They loaded it, man. Yeah, it, it was, was good. good. It was, it was good. It was, it was hot. Came out. Yeah. Yeah, came out of whiz all throughout, everybody. That's, that's the way to do it. They know what they're doing in there. Yeah. They don't mess yes. around. Their, ser their service is great. 63 years, he said? Yeah. Third generation. Yeah. yeah. Third generation, yeah. They, uh, they, they're good people. They've been here for a while, and we now we know why. Yeah. Yes. Deliciousness. And I recommend if you're in the Broomall, actually, Delaware County. Yeah. If you're in Delco area, this is not one spot uh, you should uh, pass up because this is a good milkshake. Good, too. yeah, good steak, good everything. Yeah. Um. Yeah, guys. Anything? Uh, no. Scores. Do you want to start scores? Yeah, Chris. Uh, I'll go. Doing a little more corrections on our scores, like you guys wanted. So I'm gonna go with an eight-two today because it, it was it was good. It deserves an eight range. Cause it, you know, had a good meat, good roll. It was, it was delicious. Like it was good. To me, eight and above is a good cheesesteak. So, eight two. Yeah. Okay. So, um. Yeah. As soon as I, uh, as soon as I bit into this, this was between like a eight five and a, a nine. So I'm gonna go with a eight seven today. It was good. The, the onions, I think, what is what changed my mind about everything, is you could actually really taste the onions on the steak and. It was really good, really good. Such really good flavor to it. I'm gonna go uh, seven, seven point six. It was, it was a good, good steak. Okay. Definitely gonna be checking them out again in the area. Oh, sure. And I'm sure the rest of the menu will be just as good, if not better. But uh, well, hey, before, before we head, like I said, uh, Chris was explaining, guys, the service in there is phenomenal too. There's there's probably like five or six people working and they they take care of you. So uh, let's not forget about them. So thank you to those guys and the, our lovely waitress. I didn't catch her name, but um, it was phenomenal. So yeah. check them out. And uh, hey, like I said, until next time, make, make cheese taste great again. again.